students we were discussing types of leaves we have discussed the two types of leaves simple and compound broadly the leaves are classified into simple and compound but leaves are also classified on the basis of shape and on the basis of their margin in your book it is given on page number 2 so let us see uh, how they are classified on the basis of shape how do they look like let us see I have drawn here the figures of some uh, leaves according to the shape first one is needle shaped as the name suggests you see the shape of the leaf will be like a needle the example is pine and also onion the next one is oval oval means the shape of the leaf will be elliptical or oval not fully round somewhat uh, uh, oval elliptical so uh, let us see the example guava see i have brought here one guava leaf you see the shape is oval that's why the name is oval next one is heart shaped because it looks like a heart it its example is beetle next one is oblong see oblong somewhat looks like oval but there is one difference what is the difference the difference is the sides in the oblong shape are straight these sides are straight not curved but here the sides are curved sides are curved but here in oblong the sides are straight example is banana next one is circular the shape of the leaf is like a circle that's why it's circular example is lotus now let us see how according to the margin we have uh, classified the leaves first one is complete complete means the margin has no design the margin has no design margin what what is the meaning of margin margin means the side of a leaf it is called margin the very uh, side of the leaf is called margin okay so there is no design on the margin so it will be called complete example banyan then next one you come toothed toothed means the margin uh, will look like it has teeth see here you can see it is uh, uh, it is looking like it has a teeth that's why the name is toothed it is also called serrated see i have brought one leaf like that that is china rose see you can see the teeth here this type of margin is called toothed margin and the type of leaf is also called toothed example china rose rose the next one is wavy to understand this type of leaf you have to see the side of the leaf not the front part or the back part you have to see the side on the side you can see the wave like structure wave like structure you can see i have brought this of mango mango is not completely wavy at the uh, last part it is wavy how you see only the last part is wavy see the part on the petiole side is straight but as you go to the tip of the leaf it becomes wavy so that's why a uh, few leaves are completely the complete margin of few leaves are wavy they will be called wavy like asoka in our school we have that uh, tree asoka tree we will see that and if you have uh, in your home or uh, uh, beside your home you can see this last one is spinos spinos means the leaf which has spine this leaf see this leaf prickly poppy leaf of prickly poppy the margin of leaves have spines the margins 
the margin of the leaf has spines that's why it is called spinose spine means what needle like structure which can prick which can prick in our body or soft objects that's why the name of the plant is prickly poppy so according to the margin we have seen four types of leaves and according to the uh, this uh, shape we have seen five types i have shown you a few examples but if you have more uh, types of leaves you can also see at your home or around your home thank you